Hey guys, welcome back. How are you? I hope you are doing well. Today is my first update in my big bottle showdown. This is a perfume project pan that I am doing with a few ladies here on YouTube and some on Instagram. Their links will be down below. Make sure you go check them out. This is where we target our 30 mils or more perfume bottles and any size fragrance mist body sprays that we want to. We do this in conjunction with our Little Goes a Long Way, which targets our small bottles of perfume, so 0.5 fluid ounce or less, or any size body sprays, fragrance mists as well. So we interchange these um, at the beginning of the year is the Big Bottle Showdown. At the end is the Little Goes a Long Way. That way we use our our whole collection and not just focus in on one size or the other. So the little goes a long way project is very personal. You pick how many items you want to work on and you set your goal for each item, whatever that goal is, whether it's a use goal, use up goal, or weight goal, however you want to target your perfume, you are. That is your choice how to, how to target it how to target them. The only rules is basically the size. Now, I decided to have how many? Four, four perfumes going in this project. Two are use up goals. One, one is, well, I guess three are use up goals and one is a use goal. So let's go over my use goal. It's not going as well as I thought it would. So my use goal is my XOXO Mi Amor. And my use goal for this, for this round of the Big Bottle Showdown is 10, to use this 10 times. I did well at five. My 10 is not going so well. I have used this probably four times and I should have had this use goal met and rolled rolled out and bringing something new in but I haven't. I love this scent. It's a beautiful rich juicy scent somewhat deep tropical so I really like this. I just wish I remembered to use it. I my use up goals, one is for my body mist. I do have a body mist in here, and that is my Zoella Gelato body mist. I am not a fan of this scent, guys. I thought this one would be my favorite one out of the two by Zoella that I'm panning this year. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. It, there's nothing wrong with the scent. It's fine. It's... When I read the word gelato, I'm thinking a little sweet, a little gourmand, a little, you know, sugary. None of that. This smells more floral than my Botanic Oo by Zoella. So this one I'm struggling with. When I brought it in, I was right there. I'm now right there, not very far. And since I only have until July 15th, I better focus on this one. But yeah, it's still going strong. This other one is a use up goal, but if I don't use it up, that's fine because I do use it as a layering perfume, but I want to work on it as much as possible. And that is my La Vanilla Fresh Vanilla Lemon Scent. Now, when I brought it in, I was at the bottom of this blue line. I am now at this brown line. And I've been enjoying this when I layer with other scents. The other night I sprayed it right before I went to bed and I was laying in bed going, what is that funky smell? It took me until the next afternoon to realize it was this. This is very synthetic, a very synthetic heavy scent, but I have never had it where I have thought it smelled funky. But again, I usually wear it as a layering perfume, so I don't know if it's I'm just not used to it on its own or if it is starting to turn. But either way, this has been bumped up from just a, if I use it up, awesome, to a, I will use it up, absolutely. So I have about a half a bottle left. Good news is, is I did finish up 
my other perfume that I had on my use up list. And that is my Estee Lauder Modern Muse La Rouge Gloss. Not a fan of the scent. I don't, it's, there's nothing wrong with the scent. It's just, I don't want to even say it's old. There's just something funky about it. And not funky in a bad way, but just funky as in that's its scent profile. When I brought it in, it was at this blue line. I am now done. There's just a small dreg in there that I can't get out. So this is being counted as done. So I have finished one in this project, which makes me very happy that that might be the only one, but at least I finished the the one that was my sole intent and purpose to have done in this project this year. In its place, I rolled in my Hidden Fantasy by Britney Spears. This one is not my favorite Britney Spears fragrance. I do like her fantasy line, but Hidden Fantasy isn't my favorite, so I thought I would bring it in. I am right here at this brown line. So I have quite a ways to go. I don't know if this one will be done, nor do I care because I do like it. It's just not my favorite one. So I, if I finish it, awesome. If I don't, that's okay too. So that is my quick update for the Big Bottle Showdown. Make sure you go check out the others who are doing this, see how they are doing. Hopefully their progression is a little bit better than mine. <laughs> Hopefully next month mine will be better than mine. So that's it, guys. Please take good care. Be safe, be smart, and I will see you on the next one. Bye.